In 1963, we could not register to vote simply because of the color of our skin. We had to pay a poll tax, pass a so-called literacy test. 50 years later, we can ride anywhere we want to ride. We can stay where we want to stay. Those signs that said white and colored are gone. But there's still invisible signs, barriers in the hearts of humankind that form a gulf between us. Too many of us still believe our differences define us instead of the divine spark that runs through all of human creation. The scars and stains of racism still remain deeply embedded in American society. The mass incarceration of millions of Americans, immigrants hiding in fear in the shadow of our society. So I said to each one of us today, we must never ever give up. When you see something that is not right, not fair, not just, you have a moral obligation to speak up, to speak out, and find a way to get in the way, to get in trouble, good trouble, necessary trouble. And today you see young people, and people not so young, they're black, they're white, they're Latino, they're Asian American, they're Native American, they're straight, they're gay, men and women, serving as elected officials, all over our country. We will get there. We will redeem the soul of America. We will create the beloved community. So keep it up. Hang in there. We will get there. We will get there. We will get there.